Hi everyone. In this example, I want to show you how to do a split text in both Excel using a formula and Power Query. So this is the data set with which you are working. First, we will work on Power Query. You can see that I already have a data set which is in the form of a table called table one. And we would like to reverse the position of the first name and the last name. So we go to data and then from table oblique range, add column and then custom column. Let's call this reversed name. And we will see that let, we have to give a name. So we'll just call it split underscore text is equal to the function is splitter dot split text by delimiter like this. There is only one argument in it, which is the delimiter, which we know is a space. And after that, we also keep the name of the column, which is name. Once we have done this, now we can say in, so we want to give the result now. And we say that in, and now we want to do a text dot combine, which is like a concatenate. And in the text dot combine, what we would like to do is to take the split underscore text zero and one zero being the first part, which is the first name and one being the second part, which is the last name. So in a curly bracket, first we will say split underscore text, another curly bracket, we will say one, since we want the last name to come before, then a comma and we have a space, another comma, and now we say split underscore text. Again, in a curly bracket, we write zero like this. Let's close the curly bracket and let's close the parentheses and let's see the result. We get the reversed name. So one more time, this is what we are doing. We are splitting the text by the delimiter space into two parts, zero and one, and then we are rejoining it after reversing it. Let us also see how we can do the same thing in Excel using a formula. For now we have used Power Query. Let's see a formula. So the first thing I'll do is to say text split B3, uh, the delimiter being a space, and that is going to give us two values, right? but we would like to reverse it. So what I would like to do here is to say index, but we want to reverse it. So in a curly bracket, we will say two comma one in Excel. Of course, there is no base item of zero. So the first value is always one. And as you can see, this will reverse it. The only thing left for us to do is to simply say text join the delimiter being a space and the rest is already there. So you get the reverse text like this.